All right, so we're going to talk about a very, very big thing in cats, which is kidney disease. So how do you know if your cat has kidney disease and what are the signs of it? So symptoms of kidney disease, and that's no matter what the cause, um, would be, they're quite subtle in cats, but um, weight loss is a really common one if, if it's more chronic. Cats will often go off their food quite a bit. So just become, you know, we may think they're just being a bit more fussy, but actually that can be them feeling nauseous and not, you know, they'll go up to the food, sniff it and then sort of walk away. Um, so that can be hard to differentiate from a normal cat. Um, <laughs> vomiting comes you know, later when, when things are more severe, they'll actually start to, to vomit as well. So um, those would be the most common signs. So weight loss, um, going off their food or your true anorexia, um, vomiting, and then sometimes diarrhea as well comes, comes later. Yeah, so it sounds like it's pretty difficult to really know when your cat has kidney disease. So how is kidney disease diagnosed in cats? Well, you're right. There's, there's a lot of overlapping symptoms. You know, those symptoms um, just described can happen for lots of other reasons as well. So um, the first thing that we would do, you know, if we've got suspicion that there's something wrong, would be to do blood samples. So the combination of um, looking at blood samples and looking at urine will give us a whole heap of information about cats, and it will tell us, you know, have we got kidney disease? How bad is it? Um, and if we do have kidney disease, then we'll start looking at things like blood pressure as well and doing some more sort of in-depth analysis about protein levels in their urine. There's lots of sort of secondary tests that we would we would do as well. Um, but most vets can do that you know, in the clinic and you'll get the results the same day or the next day.